Hey, YouTube family, welcome back. We got more Blackpink on the go for today. We got Sure Thing. This was a request in those comments from you guys. You were saying we got to do the Miguel cover, Sure Thing. And uh, Samantha, you're familiar with this uh, song, the original, right? Yeah, I like the original. I am not so familiar with it, but um, Sam was telling me that she knows this one. Um, but I do know a little bit more about Blackpink now. Yeah. We've gotten to see a lot of their live performances recently on the Coachella uh, Coachella run from 2023 and they've all been really good so yeah they killed those we're getting to see another live performance but this is probably going to be a little bit different because I'm pretty sure the Miguel version is like an R&B song isn't it? It is it's like a little bit slower yeah and you guys were saying this kind of shows a different side of them so uh, I'm interested to see what that's going to be like I think this is a little bit older video as mm -hmm. well from a few years ago so cool. we're going to travel back in time <laughs> a little bit nice. and um, before we do though we got a little bit of a pop quiz for you because uh, we've been adding these into our videos to see how much, how much of these blinks, how, how, how much of a true fan are they? What do they know about their favorite group? And the question is, what year did Blackpink make their debut? You guys can let us know if you, if you have that answer, drop it in the comment right now. If you don't know, don't worry, we'll hit you at the end of the video. So make sure you stay tuned. We'll give you that answer and you can see if you're right as well. Yes. And as always guys, we appreciate the support that you guys come through with on these videos for Blackpink. Hit the like button, hit the hit in the comments. And uh, if you like Blackpink, we got a, quite a few videos up from them now. So you wanna subscribe. Them. Yeah, and so you don't miss anything else, miss out on anything else. Anyways, I've been talking a lot, Sam. What are your feelings on Blackpink? Let us know and then we'll get into to it. Uh, they've grown on me a lot. In the beginning, I like wasn't 100% sure. I was like, they have a unique vibe. They're cool, but I don't really know if this is like for me, but I feel like the more that we've listened to them, mm -hmm. especially the live performances, I feel like I've really been able to grow to appreciate their artistry and how creative they are and their diversity. And I feel like they have a lot of talent and they bring a lot of passion and, you know, like I said, creativity yeah. to their... Well, you're even a visual per person, right? And yes. you really like their music videos. I do. They put a lot into the music videos. I've heard that those cost a pretty penny. <laughs> Uh, but I think that it's really neat how they have so many different costume changes, background changes. Like it's just, they put a lot into yeah. it, which is really Well, I don't think we're going to see so much of those visuals on this one because I no. think it's going to be more of an acoustic vibe, but we'll see. We'll yeah. find out. You ready? Yes, let's do it. Let's go. Baby 
every single time Look into your eyes, those eyes They never lie, I can tell your mind is so hot But you're not around and get hey, mad hey, Thinking hey, how I go and connect you around I wanna make Still you spend the whole day with me, boy Play me like a toy, I'm all used to enjoy Hoping this moment lasts long and forever I gotta feel what's so ever you my one and only lover hey. Roll it ice, I bet twice Don't think I can live a life without you So, uh, what you what are your thoughts, Sam? You know the song better than I do, so uh, let's not break it. Sorry, <laughs> I just got too excited. <laughs> What were your thoughts? I really liked it. I thought it was really cool. They definitely had a lot of similarities, I would say, to the original. And they definitely slowed it down a lot from what I see from them normally. Right. Um, so it's definitely very, very different from them. But they still brought a lot of their own flavor to it mm-hmm. and brought more of like what I would say is like a rap in there towards the end. From I could just not remember it. But from the original, I don't remember as much of that in there. Mm-hmm. Um, so was, I, thought uh, that they, I thought it was mostly an R&B vibe yeah. from what I had heard from it. But Yeah. So I thought that it was... Um, really cool to see them you know pay tribute to the original but also still make it their own yeah they did a really good job yeah it's funny seeing them they look quite a bit younger yeah as well in this one they, yeah their definitely. image is a little bit different and um like you said i i was interested to see how the four of them were gonna utilize each set of their skills because uh, you know from what we've seen thus far you'll have you know certain group members that'll focus more on the the hip-hop or the rap vibe and, and then the vocal vibe will they'll blend them together so i was interested to see how they were going to do this on the acoustic portion of a song and i thought they did that really really well you know having you know good use of the ad libs as well yeah i think they um, like you said, kind of change the dynamic in the song enough to highlight some of their skills. I think uh, it did show off more of their vocal capability in this one. Uh, maybe in some of the other ones, it's been more of a high energy, you know, crump feel, whatever. Yeah. Uh, which might have more of a hip hop prominence in this one it was the reverse i think that it was more of the vocal presence that it showed off but you know i think that's highlighting as well their capabilities as a group is that they're not penciled into or boxed into one specific way of performing or Mm -hmm. doing their music and and that was able to you know show this in this one that the vocalist can lead the way as well yeah, and I think it's cool because the original is a solo artist, right? So to actually take that and compartmentalize it into making it a group performance mm-hmm. as well also shows, you know, how they were trying to highlight their own strengths and, and make it like a group experience. So it brings more of their own flavor to it as well, I feel like. Yeah, and I think what they probably, uh, in my opinion, did as well was had certain group members add certain uh, perspectives or uh they tried to capture the characteristics of a certain vibe from a certain group member. So, um, you know, one of them, uh, you know, might come in a little more sassy and mo- another one might come in a little more um, understanding. Yeah, like you know, softer. And, and- yeah, and they're playing off those roles of each part of the song and what the message is construing in their identities on the stage and, and the way they're characterizing their vocals or, you know, making the rap portion or whatever. They're yeah. using each set of, you know, their skills their strengths, to do that. Strengths, yeah, for sure. Sure. I thought it was really well done. Well, you guys requested Miguel um, or the Miguel cover, sure thing. Yeah. And we, we came to it. We did it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, you know what to do. Hit the like button for us. But don't leave because we got the answer for that pop quiz that we gave you in the beginning of our video. And that was what year did Blackpink make their debut? And so the answer to that, Samantha, is what? 2016 2016 is is when blackpink came to be so yes that's eight years ago now no seven years ago now so um you know they've been around doing their thing as i said you know you can see their growth even from this video here but uh it seems like they're gonna be around for quite a while because yeah they're just on the up and up youtube is treating them well and, <laughs> and they're treating youtube well so that's the answer guys hopefully you enjoyed our video make sure you hit the like button leave us a comment if you haven't subscribed we got a playlist so make sure you click on that one hit the subscribe button and we'll see you in our next video See you guys next time.